Thanks for joining us today at Island Ford Superstore located on Norcross Road in Duncan, BC off the Trans-Canada Highway. We're in the Couchin Valley on Vancouver Island and you can visit us online at islandford.ca for more information and a full description of this vehicle. Today we're looking at a 2020 Explorer XLT in magnetic with black ActiveX interior, seating for seven. ActiveX material is man-made, no animal products. Easy clean and stain resistant. This has seating for seven, and it has a 2.3 liter EcoBoost engine, and it's an all-wheel drive with drive mode. It also has the Ford Copilot 360 Assist, which includes intelligent adaptive cruise control, as well as navigation and it also has a twin panel moonroof cargo management system with an all-weather mat backup camera and sensors and a class 3 trailer tow hitch it's really easy to get into this vehicle just talk to our sales team they'd be happy to take you out on a test drive and you can book that online at islandford.ca speaker in the door as well as power locks windows and mirrors the driver's seat is powered with lumbar and I just wanted to show you the release for the hood. You just pull it two times, no sticking your hand underneath and trying to figure out where the release is. That's kind of nice. And then you have your lighting controls located here, the lift gate release, the steering wheel can tilt and telescope. On the face of the steering wheel, you have your lane keeping, adaptive cruise control, there's your volume control, as well as your menu and hands-free dialing. You also have paddle shifters. You're seeing one on the left there and the other one on the right. And this is a push start, so they've put the button here, your foot's on the brake and keys in the pocket. We've got the comm screen showing on the display here and we can go through our menu and toggle through. So we have screen, select screens, audio, navigation, phone, as well as settings and display setup. And you have submenus in each of those so you can make changes there. And our uh, center screen here is a touch screen. So we can go in, go home. That was the map we were seeing for the voice activated navigation. And we can go into audio, choose our sources, AM, FM, Sirius satellite radio, as well as Bluetooth. When we put the vehicle in reverse, this is where we're gonna see our backup camera view. There you go. And we can go into settings and slide through for different options, Wi-Fi, automatic updates, and there's your navigation again and so forth. There's the volume and tuner with your hazard lights. And then you have the dual climate control for driver and passenger as well as AC, max AC. And you're seeing these red lines on either side. These are your heated seats for both driver and passenger and you can click those for more or less heat. And as well, you've got your front and rear defrost. And there's your heated steering wheel. And down in the little cubby there, you have the USB-C, USB, as well as the 12 volt. You can just close that right up. And you've got a place to put items. And then you can close that up as well. Dial shifter. And in the center, you've got your M for manual. Electronic parking brake auto hold. So if you're on an incline and you want to make sure that you don't roll forwards or backwards, you can press that and put that on. You have your auto stop start for less idle time. This is your traction control, hill descent, and you have drive mode. So you can dial through, it'll appear in your dash, there's normal, eco, sport, tow haul, and then we'll just go back around to normal, and there's slippery was the last one. There's a couple of cup holders there and then you've got your um, little cubby. You can open that up. There's a bin in there. You can take that out. Lots of room down below and you also have a 12 volt. I'm just going to pop that back in and off to the side is your glove compartment. Manually dimming rear view mirror. There's your lighting controls. You can just press that. Sunglass holder and you have your twin panel moonroof. So what we can do is push those buttons. It will open up the moonroof and it'll also bring the screen across so those are both powered for you and there's a grab handle making it easier to, for the passenger to get in. Body color door handle, keyless entry keypad, driver side, capless easy fuel gas filler. In the back you have a spoiler and a windshield wiper and just below the Explorer badge is your backup camera, backup sensors on your bumper. You have the class 3 trailer tow hitch with the 4 and 7 pin connector and the hitch and then when you want to open up that lift gate you can do so from inside but you can also double click your fob and then it opens it up easily for you and you've got the two seats in the back here I've got one down the other up and you've got this nice carpeted mat and just below this is your all-weather mat and then you can lift that up 
Off to the side are hooks and on the right hand side you have a 12 volt plus a light and these seats are just easily brought up or down by pulling the tabs. Bring your headrest down and then the back and then when you're ready to close everything up there is the release which is power release by touching the button and you can also lock from back here. It'll chime to let you know that it's going down securely and then you can just lock it up and walk away. Or you can jump in and head out on your latest adventure and on your fob you have remote speaker in the door as well as power windows. They're sitting for three in the back and the nice thing about these seats is they each slide individually so you can give yourself more leg room for each passenger or more cargo room depending on what you need. And then to bring the seat down you simply push the button on the headrest, pull the lever on the back of the seat and this will make it go down flat. You've got anchors on the back and then the, I don't know if I can show you here, there's the rail underneath that you just pull and then you can slide the seat and then you have access to the back two seats and they split in a 50-50. You also have cup holders and some bins back there. And then when you want to bring this seat back up, simply give it a push. It's back in the upright position and flip up the headrest. There's carpeted mats on the floor and slim pockets on the back of the front seat. In the center, you have the heated seat buttons. Those are those little red seats for back here. You also have climate control with the fan, 12 volt and USB, as well as a little cubby. Up above, there's vents, hooks, lighting, and that panoramic view. Lights, privacy glass in the back windows, roof rails, powered side view mirrors with blind spot information system, auto high beams, fog lights, as well this vehicle comes with all weather mats and carpeted mats and so many more reasons to visit us at Island Ford Superstore, BC's number one rated Ford dealer.